Biafra government in Ezai, formed by self professed disciple of Mazinam de Kalo Samaneba, is a scam. Ignore it. IPOP tells Nigerians. <laughs> Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Happy New Week and how are you all doing? Hope your week is filled with goodies. God bless you for stopping by. Guys, you see what is happening in IPOP? Personally to me, it's really, really discouraging me. Um, If not at one time or the other, I pick courage from one person or the other and forge ahead. But... All things being equal, you can only tell a blind man that there is no oil in the food. He or she will agree. But you cannot tell that blind man that there is no salt in that food. He or she will agree. Because he has the ability to test the food, but he has no ability to see the color of that food. Guys, a lot is happening in IPOP. But you and I can see where the truth is coming from. But anyway, guys, I don't want to go into analysis because this is a long reading. After the information we might have, you know, extracted it from the write-up from Sarah Reporter, we will come back for the rest of the analysis. If you've not subscribed, Please encourage your sister by subscribing. Please on your bell notification. Give us a thumbs up and share as well. God bless you for doing that. Let's get the details of this news. The indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, has disassociated itself from the Biafra government in Ezai, said to have been set up by the group outside Nigeria. Sahara Reporter reported a few days ago how the Finland-based Simon Eba, who is a self-professed disciple of IPOB leader, Mazena De Kalo, declared that he called full activation of Biafra government in SI, BGIL. Eba has said that the activities of the Biafra supporters and agitation we are to make sure that Biafra will totally be free from Nigeria in 2023 and forever. Adding that Biafran's final breakaway from Nigerian government is drawing closer and therefore will also wish to officially announce an alliance and activities Biafran government in Asia with the IPOP autopilots. However, reacting to the declaration, IPOP media and publicity Publicity Secretary Emma Powerful in a statement on Sunday described the purpose, the purported government as a scam and a trick intended to deceive the general public. Powerful explained that IPOB has, has legitimate, well-established institution and a well-structured administrative hierarchy that oversees the day-to-day running of Biafra affair, adding that all diplomatic mission and countries of the world knows about Biafra agitation and they communicate with IPOB. According to the statement, Powerful said, we the global movement and noble family of indigenous people of Biafra, IPOB, under Mazi Nandekalo, wish to retreat once again to Biafrans, friends of Biafrans and lovers of freedom across the globe, the IPOP led by Mazen Namde Kano, Okuchuku Kano, has not set up any government in Ezai. We therefore disassociate ourselves completely from the purported government in Ezai. IPOP has legitimate and well established institution and well-structured administrative hierarchy that oversees the day-to-day -day activity diplomatic mission and countries of the world knows about Biafra agitations and government communication with IPOP is responsible authority, authority that oversees all the affairs of the Biafran people nationally or 
internationally. IPOP has international contact and connection with through any worthless government in Asia. But thought our established institutions and structures, so anybody or group peddling a claim to have set up a government in Asia has again embarked on a jamboree like those who came before them claiming to have formed a government in Asia at one point in time. They simply do not deserve to be given any attention because this is the avenue that the Nigerian government wants to use to water down our agitation for total freedom. <laughs> Powerful stated that some disrenthood expelled from IPOP, including a former deputy to our leader, had once suggested this government in Asia to our leader. Mazen and the caliber, he did not buy into it, knowing fully how needless it is at this stage of our struggle. But unfortunately, now that our leader is in detention, though this same element saw it as an opportunity to articulate or articulate their self ambition by quickly claiming to have set up the non existent GIE. We know that their ultimate aim is to use it to sell the Biafra struggle to our enemies, but they cannot have it. They have failed woefully. We know that any infiltrators sponsored by some unfortunate politicians are fighting strongly to sell Biafra freedom through their main infiltrator hiding in Finland. He has run out of <laughs> Jimmy to spray afloat. Hence, he decided to resort to the latest claim of purported IGE, IGE gimmick to deceive his gullible followers. Therefore, anybody and whosoever concerned should ignore and disregard the purported IGE because the motive is uninterior and sinister. Biafra has established and recognized channel through which it operates and communicates with world leaders and government without needing or having to call that channel a government in Isai. People should stop supporting and making a caricature of the Biafra agitation and its project by announcing Biafra government in Isai any time they want to defraud Biafra or sabotage our own courage for freedom we urge government across the world to disregard and ignore these fraudsters claiming they are forming the biafra government in Azai. this new wing of setup setting up another biafra government in Azai is a distraction that that should not be given any serious attention though we have or have no little attention as it were we will soon fizzle them out like others before it will come thus far. It is important that Biafra and the international community are properly informed. Thus, this need to set the facts straight. The statement reads in conclusion. <laughs> anyway, you see one thing I have ever noticed with our people right from when I was little is this we never work together and up to now we are not still working together if I'm to say if I'm to say since Mazen and the Kano was extraordinary rendition to Nigeria what has this hierarchy structure? What can you specifically come at if you can be truthful to yourself? If only you can be truthful to yourself. Can you specifically tell us what you have done in awareness of this issue that happened or that is on ground? And Batman is not the colonel to liberate him. 
You set up a seat at home that is the only tool for us. You stop it and say you are working underground to come up with another strategy. This is one year and two or three months. There have not been any strategy. What you, what you guys are not doing is self-defense of yourselves. No new plans. No new strategies. And not, no longer agitating everybody. The whole media world you're focused on Simon Eba, that is doing something, that is speaking for you and I. Is the first, is this, is that, Ekberima, the one, but that, this one, the other one. Just a free Sunday, but from last two months ago, this, this cousin of Simon Eba has died down a little bit. All of you now focus on Simon Eba cursing him. Simon Eba is the one doing brokers. Exposing the Nigerian government. Yet, he is still not a member of IPOP. Yet, he is not a Biafran. Yet, he is a Berima. What has this structure done since Mazen and the Kalo was renditioned? You know the one that breaks my heart so much in the whole thing? This same structure has not been able to make investigation to know how Mazen and the Kalo was adopted and tell their friends this is where we have reached so far somebody bought ticket for mazin nam the canal mazin and the canal is staying in a house who is he staying in a house with in uh, uh what do they call it kenya, kenya. who did mazin and the Kano? The, some said he, he was abducted from the hospital. Some said he was in the park. He went to, you know, carry somebody a visitor. Either which way, which of them now? Who is Mazen and the Carol staying in the hospital with? Who are the people visiting him? If not in the hospital, who did he come to carry in the, in the airport or in the, in the park or in the garage? Who did he come to carry? Which, num which motor did he drove? In that Kenya, and who is he staying with? Because from the base of my knowledge, to the best of my knowledge, Mazina the Kano doesn't move alone, and he did he cannot start it from in that Kenya. There are IPOBs in Kenya. Who are they? Can we find them out? Which of them knows that Mazina the Kano is in Kenya? Which of them is helping Mazina the Kano? These things, you guys concealed it till today. And you want to tell us that your hands are not among the people that betrayed the name the Kano. You know, you know, to Arizrewo. To join Nigerian government to, you know, delete your own brothers and sisters. To join Nigerian government to, you know, be attacking Simon Eba on daily basis. If Simon Eba is not a member of IPOP, is Simon Eba not a Biafran? Can't you guys leave him alone to do what he's doing? He's a froster. He's this. He's the other one. Every all indication, both your actions and your words, all pointed at backing down the Biafran agitation, which you have almost succeeded, if not for Simon Eba. This video is getting too long. I'm so much disappointed. What can make me to build the confidence again in this struggle towards, towards the so-called structure? What can make me again build confidence on these people called DOS? You guys have no comma to tell us how Mazin and the Kalu was adopted till today. All you are all fighting is money, 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 money. Guys, guys, if I'm to say, anybody listening to these people, you're wasting your time. Let me see how Mazin and the Kalu will come out, see everything that happened, see the situation surrounding his adoption, and said, someone Epa has done wrong. I raise up my hand to be a friend struggle. Guys, I'm stopping it here. Tell us your own opinion in the comment section. Please, as you comment, endeavor to keep it constructively. I just gave my own opinion. What is your own opinion? We have a free liberty to speak at our mind. I spoke my mind. It does not mean you start cursing me. Tell us your own opinion in the comment section. Constructively, maybe I will agree with you. Thank you for stopping by. God bless you.